Hello guys, in this video I'd like to show you how to create simple vaporwave intro in Blender. Before, before I will start the main part of this tutorial, I'd like to announce, announce a couple things. First, uh, Blender is an open source software av available on Steam. It's completely free, so... Uh, second, um, as you may have noticed, uh, this is the first part. In this one I will show you only the animation um, creating in Blender but in a second part uh, which will be in Sony Vegas um, we will add animated title, glitch effect and basically the music. Ok, so um, let's begin with the with this uh, 80s neon grid <coughs> but before you start make sure you got switched uh, engine to cycles render Now delete this cube and lamp, hitting uh, X on your keyboard. Uh, then Shift A, um, add mesh and plane. And you can extend this uh, using S um, button on your keyboard. Uh, now go to edit mode by pressing tab and um, subdivide this a few times add modifier and wireframe and now reduce uh, the thickness to a level you want give this grid a uh, material add new <coughs> uh, change uh, surface to um, emission and uh, set color it can be whatever but I recommend this uh, this pink ok grid is ready so we can uh, go to a word set color to maximum black ok, now we can create a mountain so again, shift A and add landscape it's uh, very small so we can make it bigger by uh, hitting S Now again, mm, add modifier, <coughs> wireframe, and reduce the um, thickness again like this. Now we should add this uh, material again, new emission and color. Now if you want you can add some mm, trees, trees if you want, so let's do this by add, curve and uh, sapling tree. Check bevel. And now you can choose from mm, this whatever you like, for example, this change size mm, by uh, using S button <coughs> now you can give this a material again, surface emission color whatever you want, for example I will this blue a bit darker uh, 
and now uh, pressing shift D you can uh, duplicate those trees Now we can finally move to the animation part. So uh, select the camera, uh, press 0 on your numpad and hit uh, Shift F to go to a fly mode and you can um, fly using uh, ASD or W um, keys. And set this in a place for example, here. Okay, now to escape the camera mode, you hit uh, 1 on your numpad. And now mm, press I on your keyboard and mm, click Lot Rot Scale. Now mm, click on the timeline, the very last uh, keyframe and drag this camera for example here and again hit I dot rot scale and now as you can see this is an uh, animation how it be will looking like Okay, now we can finally move to the uh, final render part. Um, first, create a new folder uh, where Blender will save images. Mm. Here. And now you can render this like an animation, but uh, uh, Vega Studio encounters issues with uh, encoding video files made uh, in Blender <coughs> and uh, video created from image sequence mm, looks way better, trust me. Okay, so before you start uh, there is uh, one thing worthy of being mentioned. Mm, it's resolution. I recommend uh, this to set up uh, to uh, 100%. But if you are willing to have your uh, animation in 4K, uh, fill those gaps with um, thirty-eight forty and two one six zero. But um, personally, I use uh, those previous uh, settings. It's completely enough for me if you are done with uh, all those things just press animation button and wait until it's uh, rendered see you in the next part